Hi everybody, my name is Stephanie. And I'm Shelby. Today we are making something really, really incredible. Yeah, it's a fireball island cake that you can actually roll a ball down just like in the real thing. We are going to show you exactly how we made this cake and then we're going to take it to our favorite board game cafe, Mox, for the fireball island party. I'm so excited to show this to you. Let's get started. This cake is going to be really yummy. Let's start by combining our ingredients. The cake flavors that we're making today are lemon cake with blackberry filling and chocolate cake with chocolate ganache filling. We're cutting our cakes in half horizontally and filling them with blackberry filling. So glad to have my assistant here with me today and she also keeps me laughing. Here we're layering up our chocolate cake. I'm getting pretty good at this now. She's incredible now. Now that our cakes are filled, we need to cut the path for our cake. This is kind of scary, so I first use a toothpick to mark where I want to cut it, and I use my knife to cut away the cake at a diagonal. I then take the extra piece of cake, turn it upside down, and place it next to the cake to help build up the path. After I've got it to the right shape, I'm using cake pot filling to create an edge to keep the ball from rolling off the cake, and also to mimic the rock from the game. On to the fondant. I've rolled out my fondant to a quarter inch thickness and I'm draping it over my rolling pin and then I place it onto the cake. I then smooth it out with my hands. I'm going to go ahead and move my largest cake onto the board. I'm securing it to the board with candy melts and then I insert plastic straws for support. In the game, the rock has a speckled look to it, so I've dipped a paintbrush into some black food color mixed with clear alcohol and I'm spraying it onto the cake. To create the waves, I've cut out pieces of fondant that are mixed with Tylos powder. I'm thinning out one side with my ball tool and I'm attaching it to the cake. I created the white water splashes by brushing white food coloring mixed with clear alcohol onto my fondant. For the palm trees, I've cut each palm leaf using a leaf cutter and I inserted a thin wire into each leaf. I formed the trunk out of chocolate fondant and I'm sticking the palm leaves into the trunk. In the game, there is a treasure called the Heart of Volcar. To make it, I've melted some isomalt sugar, I added a drop of cinnamon flavoring, and I poured it into a candy mold. Once it was set, I popped it right out. Easy. Moving on to the logo. I've already cut the letters out of fondant, and I'm using my airbrush to spray them to match the logo. In the game, there is an idol that sits on the top of the island named Volcar. To make him, I started by molding rice cereal treats around a rolling pin. And then I begin adding layers of modeling chocolate around it until I had the proper shape of Volcar. He got teeth, eyes, and of course his scary horns. It's time to stack up the cakes. Now that the cakes are into place, I need to add the path which I made with my strip cutter. The stones were made by pressing the fondant with an impression mat, and then I cut them out in random sized squares and attached them to the cake. Let's put it all together. It's time to test it. There were some fails. But also some wins. One more time. And now it's time to take it to our favorite board game cafe, Mox. This is where we buy all our games. Here's the game, Fireball Island, The Curse of Volcar. And here's the cake. That's me and my brother. Here, I'm pitching my idea for a legacy version of Fireball Island to Mr. Davio. I'm still waiting for him to get back to me on that. Thank you all for watching. We had the best time making this cake. Don't forget to go look for us over on social media. We're on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. What are we going to make next? I have no idea. If you have any ideas or suggestions for us, please let us know down in the comment section below. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Island cake that you can... You mess up what? Ten... Island party. I'm so excited. Oh my god. We don't have the microphone on it. Yes.